Hey, this is Jonesy with another cool build we have going on. We just want to give you an update. This is a Corvette C7. It's actually a remote control conversion. And this is the radio that we used. Just a cheapie. I think it was 40, 50 bucks, something like that. Just to get us um, a 2.4 gigahertz uh, frequency. And then we've got a dual motor ESC. And some of the cool things we've done on this bad boy is if you look in here, we actually got rid of the stock shifter. This is the stock wiring harness. We literally just pulled it out, started from scratch. So we've got steering wheel, seat. Other than that, it's been upgraded with a push button keyless start. So you start that. And voila, custom rear taillight lenses. Power wheels stock from the factory comes with these lame old stickers, not even acrylic or Lexan lenses over it. So we actually custom make them. Here's your old Red Rocket. We did some smoked rear lenses on that. This one we actually opted for red Lexan and they turned out just slick. Super happy with that. Um, move the old radio here under the seat. So that's the battery for the linear actuator and lights. Stock motors. So, on to the RC. So here's the radio. We're going to turn the radio on. And under the hood here, you can see that here's the on off switch for the ESC, which is the ESC, the LAC board, linear actuator control board, the receiver for the radio, and we just got a 12 volt Gruber battery in here, just a small one until we get our four cell light bulb. We're gonna go four cell, which is I think 14.8 volts. So give it a nice little speed boost. Um, but yeah, here's the old radio. Give it some gas. So you hit backwards for reverse. It's kind of hard to steer it and uh, do the radio controls. I mean, steer it and run the camera here. Well, that's it right there. Um, we didn't get a shot of the headlights. Put some super bright, um, crisp blue LEDs in the front. And that's pretty much it. We're excited. Oh, got to show you the control board or the uh, linear actuator here. So there's the actuator and custom fabricated bracket that we're actually more than likely going to start selling. Um, so people can do this on their own. It's, it's the metal bracket that's um, right here. But anyways, custom C7 by Custom Kids Cars. If you guys like this video, please share it. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Definitely like it. Give us a comment. Give us a message if you guys want us to build you one of these. Um, super cool. I mean, who wouldn't want a giant four foot long remote control car? Um, We've even entertained of going crazy and putting like a, a six cell lipo in one of these. Obviously, I wouldn't put a kid in this, but if we went six cell lipo with a like 2300 kV brushless motors, oh my gosh, this thing would scream. We might just do it. We'll see how this year goes, and if we get slow, we'll uh, build another one for the shop. But this is actually for a customer out in California, so. As soon as he makes his deposit, we're going to finish up with all the custom touches he wants on it. And we'll get it shipped out to you. Alright, again, this is Jonesy with Custom Kids Cars, signing out.